Hello there everyone and thank you for joining me here at the start of a new campaign in Old World Blues, the A to Z series in which right now we're playing as a cowboy country, but we're using a special sub mod which will be in the first link in the description below. That's called Old World Blues Sonora Blues which gives our little nation of cowboy country unique focus view which I think I've done before but our oasis. We create our own oasis in the face of the apocalypse and then shadow of the legion. The legion is over on Arizona and threatens the life and liberty of everyone it claims over lordship over. While many refugees managed to flee from the Legion's armies, many more became slaves to Khazar's men. So as their settlements grew, we focused on helping others. Ooh, a trade. Well, manpower is more, manpower is more important. Follow the Rangers, the Arizona Rangers, pledged protecting the vulnerable from those who sought to subjugate them. Having fighting a decade-long conflict with Khazar's Legion as brainwashed soldiers. While the Rangers were well-trained and armed to the teeth, in the face of the Legion's overwhelming numbers, they had been slowly forced to abandon more and more territory. The Legion marches. The rumblings of the Legions could be heard from afar. As people fled their advance, those who came here, we offered them a home and work on the farms or in the arms workshops. We're going to go with arms workshops just because we've got a lot of things to fill up here, so. But then we do Brahmin farming. Oh, uh, and Rangers fall. The Arizona Rangers were no match for the might of the Legion. Eventually, they too fell before them. The Rangers made it out alive or allowed to take refuge but not take up arms. Still, they told stories of bravery or camaraderie. Well, Army XP is a little more important in my opinion. But we're going to get new schools uh, to get a research lab. New schools are needed to teach people how to take care of the Brahmin. Now I'm going to go with going infantry too. Well, I've got some decent divisions here. Training some uh, ships, hopefully. Yeah, yes we are. Which is very good. Anything here is super important. Uh, I mean, yeah. We don't have a lot of stability. We have a decent amount of stability, not great. And war support, well, it's actually really lacking. I personally like inspirational quite a bit. And after that, we'll get the new schools and the state of affairs. We must address weaknesses and strengthen the army. New big wells, or dig new wells. New wells are needed to ensure the cities prosper. Trade caravans. Trade caravans allow us to export our goods and procure what we lack. Trade ports. We need to be ready to trade further afield across the Gulf of Cortez. Local hospitals. If we were to fight, we need to be able to treat our wounded. Caravan militia. We need to be ready to protect our caravans. 310 Yuma. The Tohono Nation is weak and it can fall to Legion at a moment's notice. We must secure our backs. We get sca scrap scavenging. There's still plenty of pre-war scrap to clear and repurpose. Big irons. We need more guns to resist the Legion. Bigger irons. We're going to need a bigger iron. Gun show. What good is a big iron if you don't know how to use it? And local arms production. We need to set up a proper armor so our local gunsmiths can produce more guns. Also, I didn't let you know. But we are using a small, uh, besides Sonora Blues, uh, that is Old World Blues Tech Expanded. So we get a little bit more tech here. So we're right now we're doing rationalism over here. And uh, yeah, I've actually really grown to enjoy that so much a whole bunch. It makes us actually, honestly, in all honesty, a little bit more overpowered, but whatever. Um, we have. Arizona's last bastion of liberty. We have remnants of the Arizona Rangers. We've got our oasis too, of course, as we saw earlier. We're led by the people. We have kindness of strangers. And Sinaloa Red and the Arizona Ranger. The town of Ultimo came to a standstill today over a deadly competition between one of our Arizona Ranger remnants and a local cartel thug by the name of Sinaloa Roja. According to the local reports, the narco had been a local nuisance in the town for over the past few months and had been expecting the royal treatment from all visitors, including the ranger. When the ranger refused, a noon, high noon duel took place in the town square with the ranger filling Roger with lead before he, he even drew his pistol. While a small, act, or small gesture in the grand scheme of things, this act of frontier justice has done much to ensure the rangers in the eyes of the local po populace. And that's how you do business. Nice. So we're going to attack Tohono Nation as fast as we can, because why not? We love them. We love them so much, we're going to attack them. That's how it works around here. So we have advanced technology decisions. And for this campaign, because we have the Rangers, and it makes... And I, and I think it looks kind of cool. We're going to go with... Uh, where's this one? Oh, let's see. We're going to go with this one. And... But, division-wise, we have heavy riflemen, which has anti-tank, and 14 combo with infantry, which is pretty decent. We also have Arizona Rangers deputies, and I'm going to risk it, because these guys are not as good as infantry, for the most part, but uh, but they do get more initiative and reconnaissance, which is decent. So, and they're cheaper, they're slightly less combo with, they already have recon on them, so we're going to attempt this campaign while using them, so we'll see how it goes. We will definitely see how it goes. After the state of affairs, this uh, you might not be good. So we got that, I'm going to grab more political power real quick with this guy, so we're 70 already, kind of a bit, and then we're going to grab, uh, not this guy, but we're going to grab this guy for conventional warfare, which we need to work on next, and then we'll grab the golden gecko so we can go to war and have a good time.
At least that's the plan for now. But right now, we have a no, not a bad amount of demo equipment. Of course, we have like, no arm XP, so not good. We can only get 1.29 political power, we're mobilizing more, uh, but eventually we gotta take out the Legion as well as two sons. So we might actually go to war with Henta del Sol early. We do have a focus later on that lets us go to war with them uh, faster, or just gives us a war justification against them. But, in all honesty, it might just be better just manually just fighting for the war as fast as you possibly can. That takes a long time for us to go to war with them, though. So. And Jose Manuel de Cos. Yes, please. Construction and we're already going down this way, so we might as well, right? Right. Trade ports, well, get the, the big iron. You, on the other hand, just go down here to here. All up to you, There you go. Should be easy, right? Kind of like literally just walk in. And you can just circle them there, there anyways. There you go. Iron XP, please. Thank you. Come again. Nice. Now consider it a major. Picante. Organized agriculture. Let's grab some of this. Pretty folk. Nice. Very good. Unreasonable uh, demands. Put them there. Grind a little bit more. Beautiful. I got a, a stick of dynamite and some guns. But that's all we get. So that's the case. You guys come down here. Go to fight these guys. We're going to set this down so I don't forget about it in the future because I promise you I will. But the anti legion unity. Now more than ever, we must stand united against the looming legion threat. Oopsie. And threatening to wipe out our way of life. Not really way of living. Hey, democracy. We keep going this way. Starting compliance. We have more political power. Academia, not bad. And research speed, yeah, that's still pretty good to get too. Starting compliance. Surrender limit. Autonomy gain. And we'll let the followers uh, come here too. Medical stuff, that's not bad. Plus 10% more defense. We have no men to spare. Uh, we're going to come up here and start with this one though. Crop rotation. Can't find on empty stomachs. We need to find a way to increase the yield of our crops. Digging trenches. Stand around some men will begin preparing against gun storm. Mobile defense. Rather than hold the line, we must remain flexible and deploy highly mobile units ready to plug any gap. Reform the Ranger Corps. We made a mistake by disarming the Ranger Corps, hoping the Legion would not come to enslave us. It's time to undo this mistake. Did any of these guns show bigger iron? We're going to need bigger iron. Local arms production. We need to set up a proper army to sort of local gunsmiths can produce more weapons. More guns. Nice. Um, we let's go with, you know what, we're making a lot of food, we might as well start making even more, maybe focus more on war support next too. NCR support. NCR is willing to provide arms against all that would fight the Legion. Women's service. Which encourage women to serve in our military. More army at the very least. Rio Grande industrial support. Rio Grande is far too away to provide us with a constant supply of arms, but they can support us financially. Gun render deals. Gun render the best bet in getting new guns to our army. Many of the former Arizona Rangers fled with NCR. We should call on them to fight against the tyranny the one more time with NCR Ranger volunteers. Fortify the border, we hold on to every inch of our land and create a stronghold across the border. Not bad. Mobile assault. Having mobile divisions not only allows us to quickly reinforce our defenses, but can aid in our offense and strike deep to exploit a subsequent, any of subsequent breakthrough. Rio Grande volunteers. People of Rio Grande know the terror the Legion can bring having suffered from Paulus' raids, and some volunteers have flocked to a cause and TAA arms deal. Maybe a bigger bang for a buck, and the TAA will be able to provide for it. So next, we're going to grab the Golden Gecko. Sure. Just can't do too much there. Nice. Nice. And we're going to go and grab this one more daily political power because we can. And we're going to grab what? Digging trenches. Let's get some bikes. Bikes can be very nice. A year ahead of time. Big iron. Oh, you bet we're going to get that big iron. Put it for the border, of course, blazing saddles. There might be a way to prevent a war with the Legion at large. Capture the city of Tucson in a single raid and force Tucson to submit to us instead. Angels of Mercy. We should encourage men or encourage more women to serve in medical roles and helping us win the fight. Well, that's very strong. 
a bullet for the general, Generalissimo Viala, as only one allegiance himself, and would gladly sell the legion for a few denarius more. We'll preempt his plan. And so, everyone, here we're at. It is 2280, and, okay, with ahistorical, Kaiser's legion joined the war when two sons declared war on us, and this is a casualty. We've lost 17,000. We've killed off 124,000, and I've been playing this for like four hours off screen, just trying to get to this. And at this point, I kind of gave up and just use a little bit of cons commands because I've been grinding for hours, but with the victory over two sun, the legion has marked them for death, and now their only choice is to work with us. And a new day, a new dawn. Two sun's been under control long enough that the people have accepted us as their own, and we, I'll show you what our divisions are like uh, once we get through all this stuff, too. Uh, repair garages. We want two sun to trust us. We better start fixing what we broke. So there we go. Um, give us a couple, like a week. That's fine. Um, we've been researching a lot of stuff. All this stuff. Oh, my goodness. We've actually been grinding through and getting rid of actually quite a few enemy divisions, but it has been one heck of a grind, I would say that. Oh my goodness. The Legion is fine overall. But we have like no no money. There we go. Blazing Saddles is gone. So there we are right now. We've lost so much. We waited so long for all this to finally freaking happen. But uh yeah. Um it's not great, not bad, just not great. Uh, but at least we can continue doing focuses, my god. This was rough. It sucks we couldn't even form the Arizona well, Maybe we could have formed the Arizona Rangers earlier, but whatever. Um, but yeah, finally we're at peace. Jesus. That took forever. We got so much political power because we've been fighting for so long. Um, what else do we want down here? Uh, sure, we'll grab that one. Why not? There we that one too. Followers aid. Yeah, we could probably use that too. Um, after garages. Hey, we finally have a trade now. Thank God. Thank the Lord. Um, cleared the roads. Some wreckage, wrecks the riches. Let's scrap these cars. Better Chico gas stations. We should look forward towards opening reopening these gas stations and utilizing them to fuel our convoys. Yes. Talk to the priests. The priests are quite knowledgeable regarding motors. We should listen to what they have to say. Oh, get her another research slot. Wow, okay. Tank production. With the help of the priests, we begin producing tanks in earnest. Say so, the Great War tanks. Many improvements can be learned from certain these pre war wrecks. Modern tanks. The time is going to bring all life. The life of our new tank designs to surpass the engines of old. NCR wants to invest in us. We've received. An offer from the NCR. They're offering to invest in our lands and economy in exchange for accepting the use of the NCR dollar and when allowing for the NCR business to operate in our lands at a reduced tariffs. While this would undeniably be a massive boon to our economy, many are worried that by aligning ourselves closer to the bearer, we run the risk of losing our economic freedom and much more. However, NCR troops have been set at our border, so we may be wise to acquiesce to their offer. Go to war with them. Which we might need to eventually. As long as we don't become a puppet, that's fine. And we've really been building ourselves up quite a bit here too, so. Do um, max infrastructure, that's nice. So it's kind of damaged, but you know, what else is new? Uh, let's get the research slot. Another research slot, of course, would help out with what we have right now. Um, all this extra tech we can research, which is great. But yeah, Cowboy Country, I mean, I'll be honest, like I had to use some cons commands at the end just because like it, it, you just can't fight the Legion by yourself. You really can't. Um, do we need supplies? Yeah, we probably do. I grab that. There you go. Other than that, we've been doing okay. Are we still losing money? Because we were losing quite a bit of money. No, we actually are making some money. Thank God. Oh my goodness. Um, yeah, it's fine. Level ten. Hot's oh, already level ten. And as you can see, we have like no manpower, but we're mobilizing a little bit more, which is nice. Trash from Y. We're gonna this. Please go ahead. We have enough uh, stability already. So we'll do that one. So we do all this stuff. Um, I do want to go to war with them eventually, so General Pardon. We've proven our strength, now it's time to appeal to the General's principles and have him aid us against the Legion. So we need to go kill him off. Research speed. A lot of stuff we've, I've still not done yet, my bad. Population, which is not a terrible thing for us, so. These guys are part of the Legion, unfortunately, so we will need to have another two front war against these guys. Actually, if anything. Hmm. Talk to the priest, second battle for Hoover Dam, and they go to the war with Mojave territories, which is fine. Um, which means we'll probably need to go to war sooner rather than later. Uh, let's go with clear the roads. That's a crap ton of stuff, my god. And any of these research slots? Never enough, right? Never enough. So I'm going to actually leave you guys down here. You'll be under someone else. Let's show field commanders. There you go.
and I need you guys actually down here. Because I want you guys to just strike through the Legion as fast as you possibly can. Glass, nice. There you go. You can do one because you can. And what else? Max refreshment, sure. So you guys are fighting each other. Uh, we we grinded down the legion so much. It's not even funny. They have no manpower already, so we need to go to war with them asap. These guys will attack us quite a bit, but I'm not super worried about it. Um, get those things done real quick. Yes, another city's good. Finish building all that stuff up. Uh, we definitely need to go to come here too. Definitely. And. Ship's coming along. That's coming along. Let's save real quick and go back to the World of the Legion. And we'll take as much as we possibly can. Alright. Wait, what? Bruh. Oh, we gotta wait that long, really? Come on. We have a war goal against him. Oh, we have a truce, that's why. How long is a truce until turn Oh, God. It's gonna be a while. Well, that's not good. I might have to manipulate it so the Legion doesn't win too fast, but. Or the NCR wins too fast. Oh, at least are fighting up here, too. That's good. Clear the roads. Nice. Nice. Very good. Very good. But yeah, we've been, I've been playing this for hours off screen. Truck man tucker, yes, please. Poison ready to rev up our engines. Um, go ahead and do that one. Use more millies. Reduce conscription. Yeah, you're insane. We have a little bit of money, I guess. It's not bad. We could quarter ourselves, but, you know, whatever. Need a little more compliance, but we want to wait till we get a lot of the Legion lands. Oh, there go the Thunderbirds. Oh, which isn't a big deal. Oh, I hate having to wait for the stupid truce. But, you know what? Let me, let me know, guys, in the description, the description, comments below. Should we join the NCR? Only completed through events. The Republic of Sonora. Should become Rangers Never Die, which I think I went with last time. Steel Rangers, of course, versus Expand the Rangers. Holy crap, 15% more recruitable population? That's extremely strong. Or should we do Join the Rio Pact? Let me know which one we should do overall. I'll let you guys decide for this campaign. Air power. Oh, you get plasma weaponry schematics. That's actually really cool. Combined arms, that's pretty good too. Judgment day for them, nice. More coordination, yes. But we're gonna continue with tank production, which we should probably research tanks eventually too. Defense in depth, tank platoons, uh, fire platoons. You lose training time and max training level, but you get better max training and breakthrough soft attack and a little more org. Defense in depth is nice. Happy November. They haven't lost too much yet, so which is good. And we have no navy, our, our ships all got blown up. Yeah, it happens. We need more millies. Oh my god, do we need more millies or what? Don't do that. There we go. Oh, Demo. Yeah, eventually we can do this one too. Controls two suns, we get cores and stuff. Gain every claim on, in the state of Arizona. Sophisticated infantry tech, special forces. So, when Kaiser came to our homes far in the northern Arizona, we stood our ground. For months, we fought building to building and street to street to defend the farms and villages we call home. However, we couldn't stop the horde forever. Exhausted, most fled to join the California Republic, but a handful of us instead fled south and lived amongst the ranchers of cowboy country. However, legions come once more. We were able to fight them back even for a little. Reclaiming Southern Phoenix and Tucson, maybe we're, fit, we're fit to call ourselves the Arizona Rangers once more. This is almost over. We're almost done. Start researching some naval stuff. I don't know if we actually need any naval stuff, but we'll do it anyways. It's fine. Coal consortium. We're going to bullet through the Legion as fast as we possibly can. 
Ooh, actually, wait a second. Budget. Permanently adds one, but we don't have the money. Eh, yeah, screw it, we'll do it anyways. For as long as it's active. Oh, 27th of December, okay. I don't think I have to do that, but whatever, we got a political power, it doesn't matter. Well, I'll give them a little more trouble. That's fine with us, we don't really care. Show a piece. Technology, sure. More research speed, I mean, we already have enough research slots, but it's always good to get more research. A demo. But yeah, these lawkeepers, here's a division. 19 have combat with. Uh, oh, you know what? It's easier to show you like this. Um, we got recon, we've got demos, we've got fire teams, we got chems. And now we're going to have fire bases too. Give them a lot of defense. And some more manpower too. My god, we're going to need it. So you get more tanks, modern tanks, please. And here we go. Legion are going to come to war. Okay, just in case. We'll just find them too. Okay. Fine. Can you guys do anything here? Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. They definitely can. Bunch of law keepers. Ah. Oh, come on. They're having a civil war now? Bruh. We're going to take as much territory as we can. I don't care what happens. That's stupid. That is insanely stupid. Bros here. Okay, we might not join the real pact in the end. I don't know. Bro, come on. No, we we earn this territory. Oh. Let's get at least some sort of navy here. Where are those are gone? All core lands, god dang it. Where are those guys supposed to get a vehicle tech? That's good. Land cultivation, good for the manpower, which we actually have a decent amount right now, but still. Like, bruh. Bruh, Renos. Okay, I was a little surprised that they're not ready to just blow us up and kill us off, but. Sun Eater. Yeah, you know, focus stream. Oh, most of we need. We need more support equipment, this is not good. Barrage balloons, fine. Get some better planes, it's always okay to get. Just need more millies. Come on. We have no extra planes, unfortunately. Oh, we have the ships, though. Go ahead and train. Four capital ships, four, nine uh, light cruisers. There's that one. You may have a loan. Keep you guys separated for now. Come on. Let's go to war. Come on, come on, come on. Now, if it doesn't work out well for us, well, then I'll make sure it does work out well for us in the end. We got the Sky Reavers. Hey, I can offer surgeons. At least we got that. That's good. Come on in 60 seconds. Be quick or get left choking in dust. Yeah, we might have to go to war with, uh, the real pact in the end. 
Oh my god, let us just go to war. Sure. Blitz, 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 blitz. Go to the brig. Ah! Of course it's nice. Rotation, keep doing that because we need the manpower immediately. Ranchers are good, we get North Phoenix. Oh. I do that one. We need, oh god, we need Flagstaff? Yeah, oh god. We got all the way. Oh my god. Are you kidding me, bro? Well, we'll see what we can take in the war. We might actually go to war with NCR. I don't know, we'll see. Depends what you guys want to see happen. We'll literally take as much territory as we possibly can, but... There you go. Go, 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 go. speed. Come on. Of course we're out of manpower. It's fine. Go and do that one too. Stuff too. Economic resurgence is good though. Yeah, but I'm gonna fight for that up there because there's no way the Mojave territories can take all that. Might potentially put us at war with the Legion, or not Legion, but Lancia. But we'll see. Go, 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 go. And they're dead. So I might just in the end use the transfer tool mod, but I think we gotta end it there. Because we're kind of in a weird place. But if you enjoyed the video, leave a like, subscribe, review, and check out my Discord link in the description below. And I'll see you tomorrow in the next episode.